Can you name all the planets? Can you name all the planets? Hi guys, this is me and Zarabe from Eat Our Reviews and today I'm going to review this book of planets. My favorite book. I love it. So let's go into this book. And it says discover more and incredible I mean, an incredible journey through our solar system. Let's see this book. Before I start, let me tell you who is this is from. Let's go over here. By Penelope Ireland and Tori Jordan Harris. So this book is really cool. Really like this book. Give you a nice thumbs up. Planets. A planet is a round object that orbits or circles around a star and a star and reflects light from that star. A planet is either rocky or made up of that. Look guys, there's the sun. All planets are around. They are made around by a force called gravity. You know gravity, right? It's very simple. Planet journey for thousands and thousands of years People watch the star. Watch move across the star like, like a giant floating nap like this. Whoa! Let's see, let's read more. Some of these stars seem to move differently. That's because they were actually planets, not stars. Ha ha ha! Very funny joke. You see here, there's a picture of Mars. Mars is made of rock and metal, just like Earth. The first four planets, like Earth, Venus, Mercury, Earth, and Mars, are only made up of rock and metal. But the other four planets, which are Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune, are only made up of liquid and glasses. Like, look. It says Uranus is made of gas and liquid. So that means they're just made of the same thing. So that they are rocky planets, they are gas giants, they are dwarf planets, and they are extra solar planets. Whoa! Blows my mind. Okay, so let's read about dwarf planets. Pluto was once thought to be a primary planet, huh? Dwarf planet. Dwarf planets such as Pluto are smaller objects, smaller, smaller, like this one. Such as Pluto are smaller objects that also orbit our sun, like that one. Right there, let's put Ryan back into his position and let's read more. These are five known dwarf planets. So there are five dwarf planets. I only know one is Pluto. That's the only one they reveal. If you know any more dwarf planets, put it in the comments down below. Let's read about the super dwarf extra solar planets. There could be life on distant planets such as this one. Die. I really have no, I really actually know an extra solar planet. It was named like GJ something, 507 something. It was totally pink and magenta. It was just like Saturn. I don't know what in the world was that. It was really cool though. There could be life on just a planet such as this one. What is this life? It kind of looks like all the continents together, like the Earth is green, and there's a little bit of Jupiter and my star there, and a little bit of Saturn down there, and Jupiter and Neptune too. I don't know what it's called. You could tell in the comments, but I don't know. If you don't, if you know this one, put it in the comments below. It's a solar planet. Scientists are now this term planet in space that orbit other stars. 